welcome back to the next part of our relicta playthrough um last time we'd um journeyed through the cold section i can't remember what it was called and we we'd done what we needed to do and then we was um about to head back to meet our daughter but um the mainframe kind of system if i remember was guiding us back into a different location so now we're actually heading off to the relicta chamber instead so um yeah let's um watch the roombas and we'll uh head on through see what we can do if i can remember the controls of course physics just random physics books this feels like the um controls are a bit more sensitive again i don't know kind of a, a little bit weird anywho head on down talk to me sis what do diagnostics look like power surge unusual activity in all types of emissions what you're going to the relicta careful around that thing Angie. me Always the Relicta, for lack of a better name. Two years studying it, and we still have no idea what it is. Idea Labs didn't make it, I can tell you that. They found it and used it. Sometimes I wonder if we didn't make a mistake by keeping it a secret from UAG. Well, it's too late now. Or just tell your hubby that what? Sis? Unexpected crash. Reinitializing. Please stand by. Just, just turn it off. Be up. Turn it off. Where is me? Is that you? Where the heck are you? What the hell? Just, just turn it off. It's inside. It will kill us all. What is going on? Oh. Did you find? We don't have time for this. Initiate the containment protocol. Do it now. Don't listen to him, Angie. Shut it down before it kills us all. Okay. Something kind of looks like it's escaped from the chamber here. This is weird. I'm guessing this is going to like lead on to the. Um, this is leading on to like the beginning. Possibly where we were kind of like picking ourselves off the floor. Right at the beginning of the game. Hey, more rumors. I mean, what is actually like happening here? All right, no worries. I mean, everything looks like it's destroyed, but. Whoa, okay. Security breach. This is not a drill. Security breach. This is not a drill. Initiating containment sequence. Dr. Patel, what's going on in Shackleton? Why the hell are you in the relicta chamber? Patel! Angie! Angie, come in! Damn it! Are you safe? Where the bloody hell are you? Oh no! Oh, you didn't! Get out of there! Angie, get the hell out! Patel here. I'm going in. Don't, Angie! I gave you the impression. Repeat, do not approach the relicta chamber! The containment field is collapsing! Oh, I acknowledge, Dr. Alami. I'm going for a manual shutdown. You are not! Systems! Override that! Lock down the sector! No! Do it now! Sorry, but this is not about me. It's not even about me. I'm doing it for Kilo. Hold on, Kai. Security okay. breach. Critical containment failure. I was going to say, it kind of sounded like the person I'm talking to is um, almost like she doesn't want us to stop what's happening. She just wants to, like, contain it and, like, be done with it, whereas we're obviously got a, another interest here in, in the fact that our daughter's out and about here 
um, and we're trying to stop things. But yeah, clearly the whatever this thing is, its its power seems to have grown, and it's um, yeah, it's unidentified all right. malicious vector, emergency lockdown, countermeasures, general systems failure, core systems compromised, shutdown in progress. Oh, and that's Get pulling, that pulling the end. Jeez. Uh oh. Now we're in trouble. We're in big trouble now. Being pulled through to another world or like a parallel universe or something. What was... how the... Uh, how did I get here? Welcome back, Dr. Patel. Sis, what the hell? What happened? You fainted. Your Mediscans are absolutely fine now. I fainted? You mean before or after the relictor chewed me? My medical subroutines had assumed some sort of sensory misfiring based on your rantings. If you could describe the hallucinations, that would help with your diagnosis. I didn't hallucinate anything, sis. I slammed on the containment switch of the relictor, and then the bloody thing opened and just... It just swallowed me like a, a giant Venus flytrap. Hallucination logged into your medical profile, Dr. Patel. Thank you. It was not an hallucination. It was... My psychological model predictors indicate you were potentially under severe stress due to Dr. Alami's situation and the arrival of your daughter. Kira, where is she? The Solidaridad is completing docking procedures. Kira will be admitted in Chandra base as soon as she clears quarantine and decontamination protocols. I can't have been out of it for too long then. What about Alami's team? Dr. Alami's team is aboard a maglev, inbound for Shackleton. ETA in 30 minutes. Oh, okay, so? I have dosed you with nutrients, vitamins, and mood stabilizers. You are cleared to go. I feel restless. Get me Kira and Alami on a shared channel. I'm afraid that's not possible, Dr. Patel. Kira comfortable. is currently undergoing decontamination. Alami's maglev is currently in the Rimwoods tunnel, out of interface cover. It isn't my lucky day. Suggestion. You did not finish the allocated de Galash experiment track for today. Yeah, I... What the heck? I might as well do something and keep my mind busy. Okay. So I gotta remember how to. How do I open my thing again? It's IFPDA. Okay. I don't know. I I I get. I thought like she'd be pulled in, and it'd be like some form of um, like alternate universe or some other world. I I don't know. I don't think it's as clear that she just fainted. Unless like the relictor's power can make you hallucinate. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll see. Um, that our talk last night from Kira. Hey, Mum, Surgeon Player, it's pretty hectic week. We write the abstract. Too long, don't read. I think Dr. Manus is pretty happy with it now, so chances are there'll be no more delays. Should have it finished this month ago. But, you know, so anyway, to answer your points. Okay, I'll think about it. Uh, I feel about this, to be honest. Uh... Yeah, uh, too long. Too long. <laughs> Lost interest. <laughs> Sorry, I, I know I shouldn't be like that, but I just saw like a massive line of text. And if I'm honest, I'm not, I'm not like a hundred percent invested in the story and, and like the text. So, yeah, okay. All right, let's let's move on. So it looks like collectibles are in the form of like pictures and things. So. At least we kind of know what we're looking for now, which is something, I guess. Not sure who's, uh, pieces, though.
like random books lying around. I really should kind of like give it a bit of time to be fair. Propaganda. Find your heaven in ice falls. Have you been promised heaven once too often? Don't worry, we mean literally. The Tifa Galcondia Corporation takes pride in offering you in this in this life what many have been promising you for the for the next one. A new lineup above a fresh start in a land of plenty. New mining station Icewell is showing the world where the future lies. Out of it. We have posted consistent profits since 2060 and we're still growing strong. With a total population nearing 9,000, Icewell is already the first lunar settlement by gross GDP and productivity index. But what really makes us proud is the fact that our engineers and mining experts already rate us best place to live off-world. So why not join us? The first time ever... They are offering full housing and provisional citizenship services on the main hub of Icewell. Conveniently located just off Shackleton Crater in the Lunar South Pole, Icewell offers guaranteed employment and the best Mooney experience in the market. This is a once-in-a-lifetime chance to jump aboard Ice Market and build a better future for you and your family. Be a pioneer. Be an Iceweller. You'll you'll be over the moon. Um, and then there's all of the stuff. Please no prices vary according to health, age, and ethnicity. Are subject to prior DNA analysis. Offers fully customized selection of seven tier citizenship levels. Side rights, and does not guarantee an employment suited to the applicant's qualifications. All right, so basically, it kind of sounds a bit better than it actually maybe is. Going to uh, guarantee these things, but not necessarily the stuff that you you want or interested in. So. Not sure I'd be wanting to take the leap. The leap. Um, try it, given that we're probably not gonna. We'll probably gonna get stuck with something we don't enjoy doing. All right, let's head on to the Shackleton. Have we got anything this way? No, they're just the elevators. Okay. So, let's head off this way again. It's still kind of, like, very strange. Like, given the... Such a big station, there is literally nobody else ever around here. Um, okay, I, I don't even know. To be honest, I don't even know where I'm meant to be going at the minute. Which might be my fault. I may have just mis uh, misheard. But, like, there is nowhere really that tells me where I should be going. Which is kind of weird. Yeah, I, I would agree. I would agree with that. It's um, nefarious. So I don't really know where we're meant to be going. Which I apologize if I have missed that communication. I've never really thought about the um, the relicta chamber thing. I wonder if um, are we potentially getting like a, a, a sign of deja vu potentially? We 
be a be an option, right? Uh, okay, so more PDA data. Relic the list. Give a flare, flamboyant names, you know that? Okay then, we'll call it Relicta. It sounds cool, I guess, and still and will still sound cool when we get caught and the name pops in up in the trial. So this is what my team have been able to suss out. The pattern the pattern of nano nanometeorite puckering in the surface suggests the relicta was exposed from about three million to five five hundred thousand years ago. That's consistent with whoever's assessment that the nearby impact crater was around about half a million years old. The relicta was deposited or built built or seeded, take your pick, in the surface until a close meteorite impact showered it with regolith and burned it, buried it. The isotopes in each layer of the regolith confirm this theory. But do you hold your horses? All this tells us it wasn't deliberately buried. The impact marks around it are it suggest it had less than a gentle landing. Nelson keeps saying the pattern of, of spread of those root-like structures seems to be proto-organic, but he's not been very clear about what that means. I suggest we have a sit down with his team and see what they think about the batch of experiments you and was Quarizimi, again, sorry for butchering, suggested last week. Also, we're getting in deep here. I don't like a damn... I don't give a damn about the legal ramifications of this. My team is with me with this 100%, but let's keep an eye on blah blah blah. I still trust him after he's his veiled... Still don't trust him after his veiled threats when he didn't get the priority slot. Let's talk about it ASAP. I think this is where I was before, right? Eventually. Is this the area that I did in the last the last part? Okay, so collectibles aren't just pictures, I guess. Could be anything. Okay, so this isn't the right place. Like I said, it's like a bit of a shame that there's no like, there's no way that tells me where I'm meant to be going, given that I've forgotten or I, di I didn't hear or didn't take notice even. It almost kind of feels like I've got now to just do a bit of, like, traveling around. Almost see if I'm going to the right place. Which is a little, a little sad, the fact that you've just got to kind of wing it. Through the loadings pretty quick. The loading's pretty quick, but like the animation to between everything is not so quick. Okay. 
Oh, we can go anywhere in that direction. Maybe where we need to be. Just exploring. Guess we maybe want to go to Forest Place. Yeah. I mean, it's it's good it's good that it gives that sense of like exploration, but I don't think it makes great gameplay. It's not very exciting for the player just to walk around in areas with not a lot to do, like you've kind of said. Sis, any clue on what happened in the relictor chamber? Minor glitch in the containment field. You fixed it by engaging the shutdown. It looks like I made things worse. Why are so many areas dark? Can't we re-establish Maine's power? Working on that. Ah. Why does everything hurt? I feel kind of rusty. Side effect of the shock. It should get better when the second wave meds kick in. Whatever. I'll get a move on. Let's wrap up De Galash. Ping me when Kira clears decontamination. I will, Dr. Patel. I would say, though, like, since that whatever happened happened... This kind of sounds a little bit more... I don't know, this sounds different. Like a little bit more sinister, perhaps. Like an evil kind of... robot or something. So, yeah, I'm not sure what happened, but I, I still don't think it was anything particularly good. Oh, hey, he's streaming again. He sure is crazy. What's going on, buddy? Welcome, I hope you're well. We're lucky, we may even get into some puzzles in a minute. After like nearly just over 15 minutes of walking around aimlessly. be some sort of collectible or something we can interact with in the lab, right? Get some new data. Sorry, I'm so sorry. I should have thought of you. I should have put family first. I have failed to do so in the past, and here we are now. I'd say my motives were noble, but at this point, who cares? I probably shouldn't be writing this. Shouldn't be leaving any trace that leads to you. I don't know if I'm doing it for you, so you understand why I did what I did. I'm just being selfish. If a scientist has disappeared and nobody's, nobody's around, is he a scientist at all? You joke about how I sold out. Why I wouldn't stay on the stupid, moribund planet and sow my bit. My bit for what? I'd say, soften the blow for those who'd starve anyway. Pretend like we can do a thing about the eco-dynamics the previous generation screw up. But anyway, you knew how to, you knew how to prick me. I've been thinking about a way of, I don't know, making things right. Does that make any sense? As if anything I did here on Luna would somehow counterbalance whatever I did or didn't whatever I did or didn't do on Terra. Some BS science karma. Anyway, the thing on Ibn Baja, the reason why I built that tunnel all the way out there, even when no there's no economically viable ice in the crater. I've raised the alarms, I've flagged it, I've written to everyone inside and outside the labs that dared con that I dared contact. I've gotten their polite refusals and their incredibly ob obvious threats. First legal, then otherwise. That 
B, Samantha and her team are out there to get me. If you're reading this, well, they went all the way then. I'm sending you all the readings from the thing in Ibarja. Get them out there only if you can do it safely. Don't use one of the usual leak channels. They're all un under corporate watch. Go for some indie with nothing to lose. One of Luno... One of Luno Ar... Ar... Anna... One of Luno Anarchists, if there's still any active. Get this out there before re they really put the whole damn mankind in danger. They are playing with something they really don't understand and they think they can turn a profit. I'm not going to spend what are probably my last hours typing a rant. Hug all of them for me. I always loved you, all of you. Don't do anything stupid. That has always been my line, okay? Nick. Hmm, interesting. What was Nick on to then? Yeah, Matt would be really nice. Uh, I agree. Then we have to keep putting like a memory card in, even when I don't pick a memory card up. Even if being severed by a laser cutting tool, relicted tendrils show the same behavior as another source. Okay, interesting. I can only assume that they were talking that that um, email was talking about the uh, relictor. I guess makes sense. I'm guessing Nick knew the um, the true extent of Relictor and what it was capable and what it would do. Um, okay. So let's head down the elevator and see if we can remember how to play the actual puzzle aspect of the game. Yeah. Good 20 minutes of story time. Complete the gift, the, the cliff. Now recording. Track. Research officer, Dr. Angelica Patel. Chandra Base, the Galash Crater. Experiment track. You're missing a timestamp, sis. Date unavailable. What? Minor formal glitch, Dr. Patel. Nothing important. Please carry on as usual. Testing EM wearable interface. Ah, what the heck? Online. What the actual fuck? Uh-oh. That was... Oh. Dr. Patel? I just hallucinated, sis. My hands were... in a bad way. Brief episodes are entirely normal at this stage, Dr. Patel. They will stop soon. I will keep monitoring your vitals. Please let me know if they get any worse. Right. Right. It's been a stressful day. Let's finish this track and be done with it. Come on. I think it's a bit more than just being a stressful day, but hey ho. Okay, so now we have got got like the fields here. Like the portal fields. Which is interesting. So we can't pass through green, but physics objects can. Now the minor glitch was the um that's the uh AI saying that, isn't it? Ah, okay, so So, looks like, can't change that, can't change that. Mm. Looks like we got this whole, um, 
possibly like hitting Q business going on again. Yikes. My day's been good, thanks. Crazy, how about yours? How's your day been? Okay, so we can send we can send this cube over here. Mm. I guess we're probably going to need to. that to red as well. Mm. Oh. Okay, but what do I do from here? Huh. Your birthday, Crazy's dad. Huh. You had a good time. Okay, I need to get the other cube before I do this. So let's take this over here. That's how we get the other cube. Little trick that I learnt in the previous um, when we played this before. Let's take do this one cube at a time, I guess. Both of them, I think I'll be alright with just one. Then we can take this one. Mm. We're gonna stand on this one. I don't think we can. Okay. In that case, we probably do want one of these cubes. I don't know, because surely by this logic, one of these cubes will always have to stay there. Hmm. Can't pick that up anyway. Hmm. 
I'm just trying to think though. It's like, do I need a cube? I need three to get out of here. suppose the issue here hmm. not convinced no I do need it because I can only take two out of this area I, can, I have to leave one here Okay. Well, that's fine. Now, I believe the way that this is made... Oh. Okay, well, that answers that question. I mean, to me, that's not very obvious. I, all you're meant to do here, then, is that. That is not very obvious to me, that there was a button up there. I'll be honest. Not sure how I feel about that. Anywho, that gives us the ability to get these out of here. Leaving one behind, of course. I have a hunch I could probably get that out of there. Mm. Let's see mm. how much I like to break things. To be fair, what if I was to just do this mm. and that? See, now I've got four cubes. Not sure I was meant to get four cubes, but I now have four cubes. So clearly I could have done this, uh, I probably could have done this without even getting that other cube. I have two cubes here, and then I could have picked up the third, and then just got that out there. So yeah, I, I, yeah, I mm. think that's... Um, mm. My name is Nock, and I'm a serious map breaker. Yeah, yeah, I remember too. I remember the conversation, crazy. I remember the conversation. Okay. Knock the hacker. What's going on, Deathwish? 
How you doing, my man? Hope you're well. Oh, yeah, we can just do that. I forgot they can go through these green fields. In effect, I could just do this. I should have probably, though, done that as red. That's unfortunate. Well, no, not necessarily. What do I even need? That one, that one, and this one. Okay, it's fine. And then do that. And we'll do that. Move that to there. So, yeah, I don't think you even need to do half of that top area. Because I'm pretty sure you take the two cubes that are in here and get the one that you've already got access to there. So, yeah. I think I broke it. I you didn't know, break it. I did I break it, but I didn't break it. Dorm. I really like what Idea Labs did with the ecology here. Not as fancy as spare drop, but there's a certain peace here. Or used to be. Such a weird day. It is a very delicate, closed environment, Dr. Patel. Every time your oxygen consumption increases, I have to compensate for the additional carbon dioxide input into the cycle. Gee, I'm sorry for breathing, sis. 